First deliveries of the Texas Semi is going to PepsiCo, and they're probably going to be shipping Cheetos with this. But overall, I think Tesla Semi is pretty good, and I'm sure Pepsi will absolutely love the first shipment of the Tesla Semi. You know, no diesel, saves a bunch of money there. There's autopilot, which gives the driver a little bit more relaxation. And then lastly, little to no maintenance. And plus, the price of this is pretty expensive, but if you compare it to like a diesel truck, it's really not that bad considering you probably will start saving a ton of money within the first two years. If you check out what's going on here, PepsiCo accepted 15 new Tesla semis, but that's not the cool part. The cool part is this, people seeing a tsunami of Tesla semis being created. And there are up to like 38 of these. And we're not really sure how many Tesla semis Tesla is pumping out, but I'm sure they're pumping out a ton of Tesla semis every single week. Now, right now, Tesla has a lot of their hands full. They're doing the mega pack deliveries. They're trying to get the Roadster factory up. They're already wrapping up the Cybertruck factory. And now we do have the Tesla Semi fully coming out. And reports are also emerging that PepsiCo is looking to roll out 100 Tesla Semi units in 2023. They just recently got 15. If they like it, they will continue on to deliveries. Now, we're also seeing Pepsi expanding the Mega Charger network. Not the Supercharger, the Mega Charger, which is specifically designed for the Tesla Semi. You could charge it to about 90% full within 40 to 50 minutes. And Pepsi has actually installed about eight of these things on their factory. And most likely, every single location, you know, these factory areas, these logistics areas, will probably have one of these charging areas. Now, let's see what's going to happen because it's going to be kind of difficult, but we might one day be seeing these massive mega charging stations in the middle of highways. You know how there's always these massive highway, you know, gas and also these rest stops. Well, we may be seeing the charging stations for the Tesla semis, which is a big deal. And if you look at this video, this image, you know, it's just surging up. Like the amount of Tesla semis is growing and... 20% of the world's emissions in the vehicle department comes from semi-trucks. And semi-trucks only represent 1% of the total vehicles on the road around the world. So if they could tackle this problem, they're about to make a lot of money from this. So let's see what happens. I think the Tesla Semi will be extremely important because guess what? A lot of electric car companies have just started making consumer everyday EVs. A lot of these guys have not focused on the semi trucks, the big logistics. Sure, you got the Rivians, but they're like the small cars that you see shipping out Amazon packages in those like small neighborhoods. But what about these long distance, you know, logistic problems? These semi trucks. No company is doing this. Not even the famed BYD in China is making semi trucks of this size. Only Tesla. So this car company may just found a new potential massive money source. See you guys later.